Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we will learn how to draw the Rev Cloud. For that, we have to go to draw, draw here, and here is a Rev Cloud uh, symbol here. Click this one. When you click, click this, click here you will find below the option arc length we have to change the arc length type a for arc length right now length is 20 let's say you want to change it 15 enter then select and this rep cloud will be drawn there Because it's too big, we can change the radius. Again, we click here, we type a arc length and we make it to 10. And let's say I want to wrap cloud this one. So it is not looking perfectly alright. So we have another option here. Simply you take a rectangle there, okay, type rep cloud, select, select the object, this one, no, see, in this way the rep cloud is uniformly placed, still the radius is too big, we will change the radius, rep cloud, arc length 5. Now, if we going to draw, click here. Now you can see the rep cloud is okay. Still, we can change the radius. Try here arc. We make it 2.5. In this way, we can change the rep cloud. So, other thing is that very easily. Let's say I want to put whole thing under revision here. You simply type your rep cloud, enter, enter, select, and type no. In this way, uniformly you can create the rep cloud. And if you want to upload multi text, and then create a P line. First, you have to off the object snapping. Let's say this much portion. Give now rep, rep cloud select this one in this way you can create the rep cloud in AutoCAD. If you need any inf more information regarding a rep cloud, do comment below. Thanks for watching. 